Hi guys, I'm here today with a video that I've been going to make since Christmas. I'm so sorry that you've had to wait so long for this. Um, I wanted it all photographed, um, the things that I need to photograph for the blog before I start. I made the video so I could swatch things for you and things. And yeah, with not being well and having loads of computer problems and life problems, um, I kind of didn't get around to it. So whilst 90% I mean, of this video isn't valid as such, it's valid, if you know what I mean. Basically what it is, I bought quite a few beauty things in the sales after Christmas. Um, and yeah, I just want to share them with you. Um, just so you'd kind of know an idea of what I've got in my collection at the moment. Now a lot of these items I will be talking about and reviewing in the future on the blog. Some of them I may even be giving away. Because I might have bought extras. Maybe. So I just thought I'd share them with you now anyway to give you an overview of what you'll be able to see coming up on the blog. I'll pop this on the blog as well. So um, if you're a blog viewer, hi. Nice, nice to know that you're watching. And yeah, I've got this stuff coming up. Now some of this stuff, as I say, is still available even if it's not in the format that I'm showing you it in. So I'll talk about that when I'm going to come to individual things. So basically what it is, is a after Christmas... New Year, January, whatever, sale haul. So we'll start off with a couple of things that I got in the boots sale. I'm a big fan of the boots sale. But this year, I didn't actually do too much with it. Um, there wasn't a great deal that I wanted. I've talked about this before. Um, I've got so much beauty, bath stuff, shower stuff. I don't really need any more. And I don't really need any more makeup, if I'm being honest. But the things that I bought were generally an opportunity to try something new, um, which obviously yeah, you can't turn opportunities like that down. Something I did get though, which I kind of thought was cute, was a little benefit kit. Now the kit that I've got, let's see what the proper name of this is. This is Benefit Cable Car, Cable Car Cuties, that's what it's called. So it's based, the, the Christmas to holiday design last year was, the, yeah it is last year. Um, 2017 was based around San Francisco, I believe, which is where Benefit are founded. And this one is all about Lombard Street. And yeah, it's a little globe. And inside, you get three of Benefit's best selling products as minis. You have a mini professional primer, which was 7.5mm. You have a... I can't get it out... Oh, talk about grip. Um, one of the very real double lip lip liners, and this is in the shade Lusty Roll. Put that down to avoid throwing it on the floor. That's what that looks like. I've reviewed a lot of the Benefit lip sticks on my blog already, so I'll stick a link down below so you can have a look at those and see what I think of those. And I've already, always, mm -hmm, already talked about this as well. Um, with a couple of kits that I've got and this is a mini version I love anything mini um, a mini version, what's the size it doesn't say what size it is um, of, yes it does 2.5 grams version of Benefit Blusher and Rocketeur now unfortunately it doesn't have the pretty design and the overspray of the original but Rocketeur is still a really pretty one and again you get the brush, it's got a brush, a mirror and everything and I just think that is adorably cute. Minis, yay for minis. So I'll stick a couple of links down below to the reviews of these benefit products, some of these benefit products so you can have a read. Now something else I've got from Boots. I've been, I heard about these for a long time, they've been out quite a while now. And I'd never tried them. I've tried every brand that has copied them virtually. Um, and lots of brands have introduced something similar since. Clinique Chubby Sticks. Now, bear with us. Right. This is the Clinique Cheers to Chubby. It was a holiday collection. Cheers to Chubby gift set. Um, it was originally £25, but I paid £16.66 for this. The Benefit Cable Car Cuties was £9.67 and it was £14.50 originally. So this was nearly a £10 saving on this. And what you get is a lovely Clinique tin. And then you get five mini chubby sticks. Now what these are, these are the sort of lip pen stick things. And 
never tried the Clinique Chubby Stick before, so I thought this was a perfect opportunity to try out what everyone else was copying. Now, all of these colours are still in existence in the full size, so I will be reviewing this properly on the blog. But you get Mighty Mimosa. You get Mightiest Maraschino. You get Plushest Punch. Grandest Grape. And you get probably, which is my favorite, you get Super Strawberry. So I'm gonna be swatching these and talking about them in more detail on the blog. Um, because they are all available in the full size. I've double checked. Some of them are the normal chubby stick and some of the chubby sticks intense. But um, I thought that was well worth getting it because I've wanted to try them for some time so I couldn't resist picking that up. So that was all I got in boots. Um, next one I got was in John Lewis. And this was amazing. I couldn't believe they still had this. Um, this, what, this is... The Marc Jacobs Cat's Meow 5-Piece Petit Le Marc Lip Cream Collection. That's what it looks like. The box is amazing. Now, I hadn't tried any Marc Jacobs makeup, so that was why this was such a draw. Um, it was 25 It was originally £37, and I got it for £25.90, which I don't think was bad, when you see what's inside it, especially. Now, the lipsticks, I'm not going to admit, are not huge, but it's going to give us a good opportunity to try something from a brand I've never tried before. And the case is pretty spectacular. You get this really nice glittery animal print uh, sort of mini vanity case with a huge fluffy tassel on. And you get this. This is worth it for the packaging. I mean, to be honest, you could probably pay that for a Marc Jacobs makeup bag. And in it, you get five lipsticks from the La Creme collection. Now, I'm just going to show you one just so you give you an idea of what you get. Now, I'm going to, not going to lie, they're not huge. But again, majority of these are still in existence in the full size. So I'm going to be swatching them and talking about them in more detail on the blog. Um, I'm going to go through with it. I've got some pic nice pictures of the kit and I'm going to just talk about the lipsticks themselves. Now, the colours you get, I'm going to read it on here because the writing on the bottom is tiny, is Goddess Current Mood. J'adore, Infamous and Sonic Truth. So basically you've got everything from a dark plum and a red to loads of nudie pink colours. So I thought that was really nice. Um, 1.7 grams each. So as I say, they're not huge, but again, it's given us a chance to try a brand that I've never tried before. And the case is adorable and the, the insert comes out so you could use that as a makeup bag. Or a glasses case, it could be a really funky glasses case because I think I've got to fit my sunnies in there. So that was that. Now, the next things I got were from um, Tarte. Now, Tarte, um, basically there's only one official retailer for Tarte in the UK, and that is QVC UK. And whilst they have excellent today's special values and things, they don't offer the full selection. But recently, Tarte, the international, um, the US website, started shipping internationally. It's not cheap. I mean, I was looking at the new Shape Tape Foundation and it was 12 over $12 to ship, um, which for one item isn't the cheapest. However, over Christmas they had sale and they also had a free shipping offer, including international. So I took advantage of it and I got a few bits. Actually, I mucked the order up. I mucked my order up and I ended up some of the items I got twice. Completely my fault. After Christmas, I had a horrible flu virus. I wasn't thinking straight. Um, so I ended up with some extras. So when I talk about each of the, the kits on my blog that I have extras of, I will actually be giving some kits away, um, including I've got a couple of highlighter kits and I think I've got one of the kits with one of the lipstick kits is with some lipstick. But I'm going to show you what I've got. Now, I'm not going to lie, some of this is no longer available online. 
um, some of the colours and items are, so that's why I think it is going to be worthwhile talking about some of these things on the blog in the future. Now, something that is still available is this, which is the um, Tarte High Performance Neutrals Pretty Paint Box Iron Cheek Palette. Now, first of all, it looked gorgeous. This is all the sort of Moroccan-inspired holiday collection packaging. Now, in it, cardboard packaging, which is a bit of a vice, it's, um, not a vice, an irritation of mine, um, and I can't get it out. Typical, typical, typical. Right, so inside you get a sort of sp paint splattered coloured packet, and you also get, and when you open it up, you get a gorgeous sort of goldy coloured artist palette, and in it you get two eyeshadows, Design, which is a sort of a matte, a matte beige nude and fame which is a sort of chocolatey brown and you also get a blush called abstract pigmentation is excellent they blend like a dream they feel fabulous great for your handbag basically um it's really flat it's pretty flat doesn't take up much space and you've got two lovely everyday eye colors and an everyday cheek color i just thought that was a really nice kit it is still available and i think there's also like a set option that's available on the top top website but that was really nice. I'm really pleased I got that. Because I can see it's thrown that in the bargain for trips and travel and things. I think that would be really useful. Especially since it doesn't weigh very much. And I can't get back in the box. But we're going to leave that for now. Next thing I got. Now, I'm not sure which other kit I ordered. But I know for a fact I ended up with three of this one. Um, yeah, I know. I, I was must have been really deranged when I placed this, this order. Anyway, this is the Overexposed Highlighter Kit. I think both of these products are still available. Um, and in it, you got you get a mini. So I think the full size is still available. You've got a mini Tartiest Pro Glow Liquid Highlighter in Exposed. And you get a mini Exposed Powder Highlighter. Which is beautiful. I've actually now got three Tarte highlighters, so I'm going to be doing a combination post, a sort of a comparison post, just so you can see the difference between the three. Now, as I say, I definitely have two of these to give away on the blog, so, you know, stick out, keep an eye out for the blog post where I review these. When I've done it, I'll link it below so you can see when I've done it. So that's that. That was the overexposed highlighter kit. Now, I think this is the one I've got the other one of. I could be wrong, it could be the other one, but I've got two of one kit. And this is the Tarte Build Your Beautiful Discovery Kit. And yeah, that's what it looks like. Again, the packaging is lovely. I have to say, I can thoroughly recommend Tarte um, shipping. Um, I, admittedly, I got free shipping, but all of my parcels came within less than a week. Which, considering it was over Christmas holidays, I, and it was coming from America, I thought it was pretty amazing. So... You know, £12 DHL shipping probably isn't that bad when you think about it. Um, right, and this kit comes with a half-size Lights Camera Lashes Mascara. Really good if you haven't already tried this. I really like this one. And it comes with a double-ended lip, lip, the Lip Architect lipstick and liner and in the colour Muse. So you get a lip liner pencil. retractable one and you get sort of a nudie pink uh, lip colour as well so that's really nice I think this could be the kit that I've got I, I can't honestly remember now because I've got them in a box nice and safe and as I say one of the one of the kits these kits I've got two of and this one is and you get one of the Amazonian clear blushes which are amazing I have several of these quite well about five or six of these now and they're amazing, so good, so pigmented, and you hardly need any. And this one is Insightful, which I think is a limited edition colour, but I could be wrong. And this one's embossed with the design, which I think is lovely. So that's that kit, that one's really nice. Apologies, I've got no idea when I paid for, what I paid for these each. But I know, as I say, it was free delivery. It was free delivery, it was sale price, and then I think you got extra offers again, which was crazy. So if they do have the sales and everything, you definitely look out for them. But as I say, I can't recommend the customer services enough. They were really good when I mucked my order up. Um, and they were really good basically getting the parcel to us. And there was so much tissue paper in it, each box. It was crazy the amount of tissue paper. 
And the final kit I got is Effortless Essentials Colour Collection. That's what it looks like. Again, you get three items. You get the Tarte Ready Steady Radiant Skin Mist, which I believe is like a makeup fixer and refresh makeup refresher. So you get a one of those. I'm not sure what the size is, I have to check the box. But you get one of those. That's full size is still available, so I'll be talking about that. Then you get the Tartus Lip Paint. Now what the colour of this is goals. I'm not sure whether this is a permanent item or not but if they're permanent items I will review them in full if not I will just mention them in passing and show you some photographs but that's that that's the lip paint and the thing that again that attracted me to this kit is another one of the highlighters and this is the Amazon clear highlighter and this one is in glimmer so that's what that one looks like as I say, I've now got three of the highlighters, so I will be doing a comparison post because some of them look quite different, similar, but in reality they're not. So I will talk about those in a separate blog post, but that's what I got there. Um, as I say, basically I quadrupled my Tarte collection in one go. I do have quite a bit of Tarte now and I'm, I do actually really like it as a brand. Um, I am quite keen to try the Shape Tape Foundation, but QVC had it as a today's special value um, on the week last weekend. And unfortunately it was the hydration wears. I think I'd need the matte one. So I'm going to try and get my hands on some samples um, or hang on until there's a free off a free postage offer on the top website. And then see if I can get my hands on one um, to give that a go. Because I'm really curious about that actually. I still haven't tried the Shape Tape Concealer, but I have tried the Makeup Revolution one, which is pretty decent actually so you never know so that was that as i say there will be some reviews of a lot of this stuff on the blog i will link as i put the blog as i put the reviews up i think that's probably going to be the best thing to do and again i'll link to the benefit reviews that i've already done um so i hope you found that useful i'm sorry it's late but it's more of an indication of what is things that are to come on the blog so i hope you find that useful and gives you something to look forward to so obviously I'll link the blog below so don't forget to follow my blog for more reviews and things on this and of course don't forget to thumbs this video up and subscribe to my channel. Any questions leave me a comment below and I will see you really soon with another video.